Rabbi Shmuel, Om Rabbi Akiva, Truma. Rabbi Shmuel says to Rabbi Akiva, Truma. What does he use with Nidmo for Truma? Um Hadali Yukuna. He says, How do I know Truma? She's not from the Truma. So what does he say? It says Vinitmo. Rabbi Shmuel says it's not necessary because I have a posuk. And what, what is the posuk? What is the kavuchomer? Kuna. A grusha is not permitted to, to a kohen. How do you know? But how do you know maybe a sot is permitted to a kohen? Maybe she's permitted. Right? See, so he's responding with kuna. Vesu Reb Kiva, kuna menolek. Now, the most, according to Reb Kiva, how do we know, this is interesting, how do we know, according to Reb Kiva, that a, a sota, which is only suffocated if she definitely committed adultery, she's a zona. She's a zona. But if she didn't definitely commit, how, how do you know she's a zona that she's not permitted to a kohen? Right, Reb Kiva is only talking about the true aspect. Reb Yishma makes kavu from 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 kohen. Grushet is not permitted. But secondly, how do, according to Reb Kiva, how do we know that what that a, a sofik that a sofik yivada is not permitted to a kohen? That's the most question. The suda Reb Kiva kuna minole bechitem et kuna lo tzrik al kro. You don't need a pasuk. Why? Should he also be sofik zayno kiv zayno? If we say sofik yivada, if she committed adultery, there's no question she's not permitted to a kohen. She's a zayno. And he was saying, Savi Gavadei. So if it's the case, Tiboy, Truma Nami Lu Tiboy, Kramonov Shoch. Shari Osobo, Savi Gzayni Kazayna. If you tell me Savi Gavadei means we, we classify her as a zona, and that's why I don't need a post to say why she's not permitted to a Kayin, so why do I need a post to do the, three vin, the third Vinit Mo to tell me she's not permitted to Truma? She's a zona, she's not permitted to Truma. No, 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 no. We're talking about the Wiskinian Stira. Kinu and Stira, let's say a husband dies. Uh, he dies, she's an Almon. Almon is permitted to a Kohen. But over here, it was never resolved that she committed adultery. So we say, Savik Evadai. So we're saying, he needs a post to say, even though Savik Evadai, I would say normally she would be permitted to eat Truma. Right? I need a post. So the Mara asks, but why, why to be permitted to, to be forbidden to a Kohen? I don't need a post. Why not? And Savik Evadai. That Savik zone is Kizonas, if that's case, I don't need a Pasuk with Truma either, because the zone is not permitted to eat Truma, because the zone is, a, is like a Chalola. El Rebbe Akiva, Arbo Kroi Ksivi, I have four Pasukim, I have four. Chad Leboil, Chad Lebal, Chad Leboil, Chad Lekuna, the Chad Truma. You this? I have three Pasukim. Rebbe Shmuel, Tlosa Kroi Ksivi. Rebbe Shmuel, why? Because we had, we'll see in Rebbe Kiva, we had early Darshan's Vov. So it says vinitmo, it says nitmo nitmo, then it says vinitmo. So the vav is like a fourth nitmo. According to Rabbi Shmuel, the Gemara said Am Amad Aleph, he doesn't dash in vavi. So therefore, according to Rabbi Shmuel, I only have three psuk, I only have three nitmo, right? Because the vav is not counted like an additional nitmo. Rabbi Shmuel, tlosik roiksivi, chad lebal, chad leboil, chad letruma. Ukuna asy bekal v'chomer. Ukuna he learns from Grusha, right? That he learns from Grusha. Ukuna asy bekal v'chomer. Rabbi Shmuel, my did so crawl the truma. How does Rabbi Shmuel know the posuk comes to teach me? Be my did so crawl the truma, kuno, asiba kalvachomer, dilma kitzrich lakuno. Maybe the posuk comes to tell me she's not permitted to a kayin. U truma shario. Maybe she's permitted in truma. If I have three psukim. If you tell me she's not permitted in truma, then I have a kalvachomer to learn kuno from, from Grusha. Right? Because when Grusha is permitted in Truma, she's not permitted to a Kayin. So this one's not permitted in Truma, definitely should not be permitted to a Kayin. So Mar said, how do you know? How do you know to learn the Pasuk is going on on Truma? On Truma, maybe it's going on Kuna. And maybe she's permitted to a She's permitted to eat, what's his name? She's permitted to eat Truma. Stama, and you have to understand the whole shtickle here. If she's not permitted to a Kayin, why isn't she permitted to a Kayin? Because she's a Zaina. So she's a zona. What do you need a pasuk? She can't eat truma. So evidently, if you need a pasuk, need to tell me she's asura lekayin. No, which means she's not a real zona. She's not a real zona, right? That's included, right? She's not. We, we treat her as that. So ain lechob elichidusho. We're not like that, but truma, she she's that. But that that the so that the says, how do you know to to use vinit mo? To tell me she's not permitted bitruma, and then I make a call from Grusha. Uh -huh. Maybe her nitmo nitmo is going on truma, mm -hmm. and maybe she's permitted to coin. It's going on kuna, and she's permitted to truma, like a Grusha. Right? Dilma kiitzuk the kuna, u truma shario, 
Omar Loch Mistavro, do me the Balu Boyo. Now he says, of course, the first bit by Echod Labal Echod Laboyo. Okay, one second. Ma Balu Boyo Michaim. When is it relevant, Balu Boyo? When, 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 when she's alive. When is she not permitted? When? Right, when they're all alive. Av Truman Nami Michaim. La Fuge Kuna, La Chamisa. Truma Kuna is after Misa. After she's widowed. Right? They're, they're fully fucked. The husband is, can't be with her. The boy cannot be with her. Okay. If you talk about Kuna, like, like this is what you, you, Judah, you brought up, she's a Grusha, she can't marry him. Good. So it's being where the husband died. Good. And now she's now mother, is she permitted to a Kayin? So, mm -hmm. But it's not in sync with the other cases. So therefore, it's all, all speaking, when they're all alive, she's not permitted to the Baal, to the boy and Truma. If you, if you can talk about Kuna, what's the Kuna Nogea? What, what is the relevance to? Only if she was widowed. But then it's not similar to Baal and Boyle, because Baal and Boyle is where they're alive. So I have Truma, so if I have Truma, now I have a Kalvachoyme from Grusha. Grusha is permitted in Truma, and she's not permitted to a Koyen. So this woman who's not permitted Truma definitely is not permitted to a Koyen. You have a Kalvachoyme? Rip Kiva. Dum yir Baal and Boyle? Less late. That to say that the third Nitmo has to be similar to the first, he doesn't hold that. So therefore the case is, so what, do I, what would I use the third Nitmo for? I use it for a, I use it for a, for Kuna. I use it for once I have Kuna, I need a fourth one for Truma, right? Because the, what's the basis? If I learn it's for Truma, then I know Kuna from a Kalvachomer, because the Kalvachomer is from Grusha, right? Because a Grusha is permitted Truma, she's not permitted to Kayin. So this one's not permitted Truma. Definitely, it's not permitted to Kayin. But let's I learn the third Vinditmo is going on, on Kuna. So she's like a Grusha. Maybe she's permitted in Truma. If I need the fourth, the nitmo, the vov, to say she's not permitted in truma. Vinami isle milsed asmakal v'chom torkel kosel akro. Finished. We find throughout Shas there's a concept. Something, although it could be derived from a kal v'chom, the Torah goes out of its way sometimes to write a pasuk to learn it from a pasuk. Milsed asmakal v'chom torkel kosel akro. It's interesting. The, uh, the Gemara says, uh, the Mishnah says in Sanhedrin that if a Bezdin makes a mistake in Dovisha be Mishnah, so they undo it. They undo the Psaka of Bezdin. It's Dovisha be Mishnah. It's something you should have known. <laughs> what about if it's Shikul Adas? What if it's something which is Shikul Adas? Then you don't overturn it. Shikul Adas. If the, meaning, we'll see. I'll tell you what Shikul Adas means. Most people don't have shikaladas, okay? If it's shikaladas, something which is explicit, they make a mistake, it's on the books, you actually you overturn the Even though it's a Sanhedrin, you overturn their ruling. But it's shikaladas, you don't overturn it. That's called a zelusa de bedina. It's a disgrace to the court to overturn it. Something which is obvious they made a mistake, you can't leave it. <coughs> but something which is similar is what shikaladas, there's a machlok samura, machlok stanoim, and it hasn't been resolved, who do we rule like, one or the other? And you're able to bring a rye from somewhere in Shas. So that already, it's already a might. You have to be already a, at a certain level. In that case, that's Shikla Das. To, to bring a rye to one of the Shitas, and, and because of that, we pass it that way. So that's not called explicit. That's called Shikla Das. Tomorrow's Sanhedrin. What's the concept? It's already, you have to be a little bit of a lamnin. You have to be a bar seichel. But if the Torah, see, even though Bilsa Asma Kalfon Torah Kosova Kro, the Torah goes that writes a posuk that it's considered it's Mufush Bikro. That's why the Torah writes it. Because it's another level. Kalva Khaime, it's it's what Yib Gun Yud Gimul means that Torah in the But it's not simple. It's not simple. Omrav Gidul Amarav, we had earlier. Dov Sheshbo Dasli Shol, the Aimbo Dasli Shol, by Kro Nafka. Now we said earlier. We say Savi Tumbushai Yochid is what? Is Vali Tomi, even though there's a Cheskes Tyro, Dovishish because we, we talk about you have the Baal, you have the, the, ba, the, the Boyle, and the Isha. So we're talking about people. They're, 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 they're people of intelligence, meaning, so if a person himself had a question, did he pass over a grave, did he not pass over a grave? So who's, who's the Shaila? That's a Bishish Dasli Shoil. He has a question, did I go over the grave? But let's say you come and you find a Sheretz near Tyrus. The sheretz is aimbo dasli shol, and the is aimbo dasli shol. So what do I do? Even with shesai yochid, we said, the Gemara said before, the tyrus have a cheskes tyrus. So we say the sheretz did not come in contact with what? With the tyrus. 
But if it's the person himself, then he's Dasi Shoyal, right? By the way, Tosis says, we have mentioned that the halochi is that it, when we say Sofi Kevadai, even though you have a Chazoka, even if you have a Chazoka, Cheskis Tairo, you don't go after the Chazoka. That's Sofi Tumushu say, Yoche, it's Fekut, Tomi. Vadi Tomi. Because you learn from Sota. Now, when do you go after the Chazoka? What's the Lomdis? When do you go after the Chazoka? No, Aaron. When do you go after the Chazoka? When, when you have a Tosis, if you have it. The Irizal, Sofik, go after the Chazoka. Right? But if Torah says Sofik Vada, there's no Sofik. You understand? Sofik Kevada, but it is Cheskis Tyra, but Cheskis Tyra only plays when you have a Sofik. Torah says here the Sofik is Vada. Vivo Chazok has no relevance. Good. Okay? That's, that's the Lomdis. Okay? So now, so Torah says, Akasha, where do we learn, see that Sofik Vada? Because you find a woman, she's, she, she, after Kinyan Steer, she goes, she's so so with a man. So we say, although she has a Chazok, we say she's Vada Tmeo. It's even though we don't know what happened. So Tosis on that vase, that Tosis I mentioned, I need that vase of Manalf is a question. But the, she has no chazoka. Once she, she had kino and she goes into stira, her chazoka is breached. It's Israel of chazoka. So what, she has a cheskis kashrus? So, so how do we learn from there? How do we learn from there that Sophie Givadai, the reason why over there she's Tameo is because it's a Sophic. And since she no longer has a cheskis kashrus, because it's been breached, the cheskis kashrus. So how do you learn from Saito the Tuma that what that Sofi Gavari even we have a Cheskis Tyro that's Tosis Kasha on the Vezo Manal of Nido you had a question so Tosis answers he says something interesting he answers that even though she doesn't have Cheskis Kashrus that she didn't commit adultery but she doesn't have a Chazok that she did commit adultery so that's also called the Chazok she has a Chazok she's not body in adulteress mm. it's not a Cheskis Kashrus but it's not a chazoka. She is an adulteress. It's, it's it, it, the chazoka. She's a sophic. So why is she vadi? It's not his chazik. Yeah, yeah. So that's that's he says. He says even though she doesn't have a cheskes vadi, we treat her like vadi. Therefore, even when you have so you see, even there's a degree of chazoka. Therefore, you don't you don't utilize chazoka. Therefore, it's sophic sophic vadi. That's those his answers. Take a look. It's a choshev tosis to see. Omar Rav Gidol Omar Rav. Do v'sheish put. No, she doesn't have a cheskes kashes, but she doesn't have a cheskes vade seita. So that's called those heis teichet the chazok. That's called the chazok. Omar Rav Gidol Omar Rav. It's interesting. There's certain memories in Shas. Omar Gidol Omar Rav. It sticks in your head. Heinein hadvor v'hanikin ba'mira. That's Omar Rav Gidol Omar Rav. There's certain things. There are a number of things in Shas. Omer of Gidel Omer Rav. Okay, Omer of Gidel Omer Rav. Dovishish for Das Lishol, Vein Das, Vein Das Lishol. Micro Nafka. This is what you learn from the Posuk. It says in the Posuk, Vabosa Sheyiga, Behold Tome, Lo Yochel. Lo Yochel. Bosa, you have a second. Vabosa Sheyiga, Behold Tome, Lo Yochel. Beishli Soreif, Vabosa, Kol Toro Yochel Bosa. Okay? Abosa she yiga bechol tome lo ye ochil. So what's 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 the connotation? Vaday tome vaday tome who the lo ye ochil. So what's the connotation? If it's no gea, you should not eat it. So what's the inference? Hosofik tome v'sofik tor ye ochil. Why? Because the the, the meat has a cheskis tyro. It's cheskis tyro. Ei masefo v'aboser kol tor yochel boser. The bo- it called Tor Yochel Boser. Vade Tor Hu Di Yochel Boser. Ha Sofik Tomei, Ha Sofik Tomei, Lo Yochel. So we have a stira. So how do you reconcile the two? El Lav Shvami No. Kan Che Yishbo Das Li Shoyel. Kan Che Yishbo Das Li Shoyel. Yeah? If it's Das Li Yishbo Das Li Shoyel, if there's a meat, did the meat become Tomei or not? You go after Cheskis Tairo. The meat has no, is not Das Li Shoyel. But let's say the person himself has a question. Well, did he become tummy? Or when, let's say when he was engaging with the bosser, did, did he contaminate it? Mm-hmm. So because of his level of association with it, that's called dasli shoyel. Okay, the itzur to Rav Gidel Amar Rav the itzur chlemigma misaito. So why isn't this pasuk sufficient in its own right? Right, this pasuk should be sufficient in its own right. What do we have to learn from Sota that the Sota is dasli shoyel, right? Itzur. Rav Gidol Merav Yitzchak Lemig Mesav Dimidrav Midrav 
have a mina bein b'shus ha'echol b'shus ha'rabim. I wouldn't differentiate, right? If I just had that pasuk, it says whenever it's dasli shoel, it's always tummy. We don't make any differentiation whether it's shusar rabim shusar rit yochid. It's a chlemig me so it's therefore I have to learn from sota. Where does sota take place? Shusar rit yochid because the soser. Vi misota have a mino adi kodas nogea umagia, right? There were two people involved. The, the, the Nogea is Das Lishoel, and the woman, they're both Bali Das. Mm -hmm. So I'd say maybe whenever you have a Sophie, you go to Khumro. They're both, so let's say a person and, uh, came in contact with something, a grave. Even Rosh Hashayochri is not Tommy. Because the grave is not Das Lishoel, right. it's only the Nogea, right? But here. But, right? Das Nogea Umagia. So therefore, I need both Psukim to say no. You only have to have Das Lishoel, but what you come in contact with does not have to be Das Lishoel. Okay? It says, Boba Yom, it says, on the day that they actually removed Ram Gamliel, they darshaned many things, right? The Mishnah goes and enumerates many things they darshaned. Boba Yom, Dorsher, Bki, Bechol, Chli, Cheres. What he learned that a, a, a Shani makes a Shlishi, Chulin, right? Because it's Kol Hashem, Bechli, Yit, Mo. It doesn't say Tomei, correct? It means it has the ability. So Kli is what? A Kli is a Shani. Excuse me, the food that you put in the kli is a shani, and it says that is yitmo. That means a shani makes a shlishi. And the Pesach speak speaking about even chulin. It's not limited to kochim. It's not only by kochim a shani makes a shlishi, a shani makes a shlishi even by chulin. You get it, Howard? What, what does it mean by chulin? Chulin is, is uh, a regular food that you, you come So if you put a piece of bread in, in a kli with a sheritz, it comes in no, it doesn't come. It's just okay, in the avir. The bread is tummy. What is the what is the bread? A shani. Right. The, yes. It's a shani. We don't see the shirts touch. It's, it's like enough. the shirts is metami the kli it's and then it's, so it's a shani. And it says yitmo. What's yitmo? It it will contaminate. Oh, Doesn't say tome. Yitmo. It will. Yosef A second makes a third. That's where he keeps drosha. Umeacha deilo deilo lome tome. Oh, wait. So the says like this. It says, Ram Gamliel learned it, said it's Tomei, but he says in the future generation, somebody is going to come and prove that it's Tor. So they said to Ram Gamliel, they said, to, they said, but they said to Rabbi Yochanan and Zakai, Rabbi Yochanan and Zakai, they said, what do you mean? But your Talmud learns, has a posuk, and you can't refute a posuk, right? That's the Mishnah. Mishnah, they said to Rabbi Yochanan and Zakai, how could you tell me that in the future there's going to be somebody coming disproving, and it'll be tor. How could it be tor? The Pesach says, it's a Pesach. So, Omer Rebbe Yudah, it says, what did what Rebbe Yochanan Manzake hold? Omer Rebbe Yudah, Rav, Minat Torah, Inlo. There's no, Rebbe Yochanan Manzake hold, there's no Pesach. There's no Pesach. No, no, for Chulin, that Chulin makes a Shlishi. That Shani makes a Shlishi. There's no Pesach that Shani makes a Shlishi. By Chulin, by Chulin. No, we didn't get to, if it's Chulin, it's Kosh game, it's Kosh game, what's his name? If a sheni makes a shlishi by chulin, I don't need it. What do I need a posuk? No, 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 no. How do we know that a sheni makes a shlishi by chulin? Right? So Rabbi Yochanan and Zake held that what? That it's learned from somewhere. So what does it mean, Eno? Eno means there's no explicit posuk, Rabbi Yochanan. A kalvachom you have. What's the kalvachom here? Midi kalvachom a yeshlo. Umat tful yoim. Okay, what's a tful yom? person goes to the mikvah. And what happens? He has to wait till Arab Shemesh, to be Torah. Right. A tful yom, the, what's the if something is tome or something becomes posu? Let's say truma. A tful yom touches, touches truma. What happens to the truma? What's its classification? Is it tome or posu? No. It's posu. Po, the word posu means it's invalidated, but it cannot pass it on. See, if a Parisian touches truma, the truma becomes a, becomes a shani. Shady makes a shlishi. Of course, it could be passed on. Postal means it ends right there. It's invalidated. It has to be burnt, but if that touches somebody else, it's not going to be metami. Okay, that's the meaning of postal. So we make a kavro. Umat ful yom shemute bechulin. Postal be truma. But yet, if he touches truma, he invalidates the truma only to the point that it's, it's limited itself. Kika shady she postal bechulin. 
the Kikashani, which is Chulin, which passes the Shlishi. Yeah, even though it's Chulin. And Odin Shiasa Shlishi be Truma. Right? So definitely it should affect Truma, that a Truma could be a Shlishi. Yeah, 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 the Kabbalah Homer. So I don't need a, uh, He has no. It's a Kalvach Homer. How do I know that it's it's metameg? Because it's Kalvach Homer. Because Kika Sheni should possibly chulin. It's possible chulin and Odin she has a shlisha betruma equal to mifra. So those over here is a question. Again, Omatful Yom Shemuta bechulin posel betruma. Kika Sheni should possibly bechulin. The chsiv. How do we know a kikasheni becomes possible chulin? Right now, we're not talking about to make a shlishi. Kikasheni kosher betochu yitmo chulin utruma gukodim b'mashum adinu she has a shlishi betruma. Now, Rashi, we have a principle like this. Whenever you make a kavuchomer, we have a principle dialogue minadil yoskin nidon. The kavuchomer is limited to, to the, where you begin. What do I see? According to Rabbi Yochanan Zakkai, we see that chulin you could have a sheni. It says, because if you put the food that goes into the cleave with the sheretz, it becomes a sheni. So if chulin could be a sheni, and a ptul yom apostles be truma, so definitely the sheni should make a shlishi. By, what are you talking about? You just sh- said to me that what? That what? Shlishi means it contracts it on, passes it on. But what do we see from chulin? Chulin, we don't see, but chulin could become more than a sheni. So how do we know to make that leap? The quantum leap to Shlishi. What? It's Dayu. There's a principle, right? Dayu means Lios Kenidin. You cannot extend the Kavachome beyond where you began. Chulin, do we see Chulin goes beyond the second? We don't see it. So how do you take that say? So that's the case. Petru will make a Shlishi. That's beyond what I see by Chulin. How could you draw from the Kavachome more than you see with, 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 with the basis? So Rashi says principle. Tell you the same thing. What about, there's a concept, you don't say die when it's mifrach kalvachomer. Meaning that, let's say I have a kalvachomer, but factually, I don't need the kalvachomer because of dayu. If it's dayu, so why do I need the kalvachomer? It's understood. If it makes a shlishi, it makes, it makes, a, it makes a shani. So truma, of course, is a shani. But I have a kalvachomer. The kalvachomer tells me it overrides, it overrides the dayu. Mm. Instead, Rashi says it before this year. He says... He says, You see, next to the last line. I mean, I have the posuk. The posuk is whatever is the clearest tummy. So that means what? Like the 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 posuk is the whatever is the clearest tummy. What am I going to say? Whatever is the clearest tummy is limited only to chulin. If it's chulin, why can't it be truma? But I, so what? I have the, so what is the value of the kalvachomer? Factually, there is a kalvachomer. It can't be limited because limited. I have the posuk. So if it out the Kabbalah tells me you go beyond the limitation. So wh- where do you go? Makes a shlishi betruma. Again, it's a very important rash. It's it's a she, it's gemara in bavakama. That when it's mifrach Kabbalah if I don't need the Kabbalah then the Kal- then it goes beyond the scope of the limitation of the Kabbalah Okay. So that's what he says. Ki kasheni shaposel bechulin and odin she has a shlishi betruma. So it's equal to mifrach. Yeah, you could you could actually there's there's a weakness. You could refute the Kabbalah now, the one right now on this is what is Tful Yom? A person, let's say, has, is a Zov, has a flow, goes to the Big Fibur of Shemesh, right before them. So, there, the Tful Yom, it's what? It's Migufo. It's, well, the source of the Tuma comes from himself. You can have a, a, a Tful Yom, you touch a Sheritz, so that's not himself, he, that he contracted it from outside. Goes to the Mikvah, waits till nightfall. So, right now, the Gemara understands Tful Yom. Tful Yom is supposed to be Truma. Right? That's what he said. Tful Yom, which is supposed to be Truma. And Kiki Sheni Bechulin said, definitely, it should make a Shlishi Bechuma. He says, no. Ikle Mifrach Malet Tful Yom, Shkain Avatuma. It's an Avatuma. The Tful Yom, before he became a Tful Yom, what was he? A Zav. What is he before he goes to the Mikvah? He's an Avatuma. So that's much more serious. You want to draw from a Sheni to make a Shlishi, but that, that's contracting it. Then it starts with the person himself. Okay, Malfu Yom Shkain Avatuma. That's the reason why he's supposed to be Truma. Samar says no. Tful Yom is not necessarily where he's an Avatuma. Taisi Mitful Yom the Sheretz. We're talking about the Tful Yom where he contracted it because he touched the Sheretz. 
So what is he? He's a Rishon. He's a Rishon. Okay, to Yom the Sheretz, Matful Yom the Sheretz. So Mars is still. She came out Sinu, the Minu Avatumo. It's on the first, first column, the notasis. See over here. Rega. She may not get clear there or Odom. Zebeman be mess, Nasa Avatumo. The Tommy Odom, the Caleb, Tommy Boechel, Shane and Nasa. He says, Phenomenal, phenomenal. Nimi. The halacha is the only thing that could become an avatuma is something that has tyra b'mikvah. Something which does not have tyra b'mikvah cannot become avatuma. It's a very, very important principle. Yeah? Here, a human being can become has tyra b'mikvah. So if a human being touches a mess, what does he become? Yeah. Becomes an av. Right. Mess is avi avoy. Right. He becomes an av. Right. Right. A kli has tyra b'mikvah. Okay. So he becomes an av. Uh, what about food or drink? No. No. You can, food becomes tummy. It's gone. So it doesn't have tire be mikvah. So if that's the case, maximally it becomes a rishon. So that's what we're asking. There's no kal- there's no question. A tful yoim who could become an avatuma. That's the reason why he invalidates the truma, Good. right? But food, we want to bring a rice. Shani makes a shlishi, which is ochel. Ochel can never become an av. So maybe you can't draw that. You can't you can't draw that conclusion. That's the morskasha. Do we prove that food can't... Uh, no, it's based on Pesukim. It's based oh, on Pesukim. Okay. Rashi brings the Pesukim. Take a look in the Pesukim. Im hoyo nogea b'kli, take a look. Shken yishminu avatuma. Im hoyo nogea kli ze, o odom ze b'mes nasa avatuma, l'tami odom b'kelem, to b'ochel she'en en nasa avatuma. Afila ha'idei mes. Why? Dechsiv. Here, you see Rashi? Okay, start the facing it. Okay, dechsiv. B'chol ashe yigabo ha'tome yitmo. Umocha nafkalon, tome mes de metami odom b'kelem, Al korche b'tomi mes sheish bo tyro b'mikvah ksiv to ksiv leil minei visa torah latomei speaks about over there associated with this regarding the poradumo. aduma visa torah latomei v'rochatz b'mayim dov sheish bo tyro nasa avatuma the maga tomi mes ay the maga mes yotzu ochel mashki muklicheres sheilem tyro so therefore that's 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 already that's a pirchon the kalvo chomer. How do you draw from, from Tul Yom? Tul Yom is the person, he could become an Avatum. Right. But Ochel Mashke, maybe not. So maybe you can't, you can't draw it that far. Okay? Right? What's Klicheres Yochiach? Rega? Right? The Klicheres cannot. Right? Because it's Alochi Yishover. You break it. It has it has no tarim no b'mikvah. Yochiach malchi cherishki metami ma'aviro has a different chumra, right? You, you, the sheretz doesn't even have to touch the kli. Tul yom yochiach v'chozer adin lo rizek rizek v'lo rizek rizek tzaroshav end shumutorim b'chulin uposlim b'truma. A tul yom is permitted to eat chulin, correct? But if he touches truma, he invalidates it. Koshkim ki gosheni shuposel b'chulin the poisel b'truma, right? Okay, that was the Kalvah Choymer, Rabbi Yochanan Metzakeh. He said, in the future, there'll be a, somebody coming which will find a Pircha on the Kalvah Choymer. So what, what's going to be the Pircha? It seems to be a good Kalvah Choymer, right? The Dorach Porich, you know, the Dorach is going to come, because we're learning now, it's a Tzad HaShoveh. You need a Tzad HaShoveh to establish this Kalvah Choymer. It's really a Tzad HaShoveh. The Dorach Porich, Mal Tzad HaShoveh, Shebehen. Shkein Yishlo Bet Tzad Chomor. Here, there's a, you know, the Gemara says a number of locations, to, to, to refute a Kalvah Chomer is not so simple. But a Tzad HaShove, if it's, slight, if, if it's slightly off, it's enough you do away with the Tzad HaShove. But is it, is it, it has a Tzad Chomer. What's the Tzad Chomer? Tful Yom could become an Avatuma. Kli Cheres Metabi Yaviro. So both of them share a commonality. They both have Tzad Chomer. But Ochel doesn't have that Tzad Chomer. So therefore, as a result of it, you can't learn out, not from Tful Yom, and you can't learn out from Kli Cheres. She yash tzad chomer. So why Rabbi Yochan hold him? It's a valid tzad hashover. Rabbi Yochan zag tzad chomer lo porich. So the future generations he held that will be mafrich the tzad hashover. They're going to come up something that it's not perfect. It's not a perfect fit. So on that, that's what they said to Rabbi Yochan Mitzadi. What do you do with, with Talmidoch? Talmidcho Rabbi Akiva. He has a posuk. A posuk you can't do away with a posuk. It says yitmo. Okay, very good. Everybody's with me. Howard. Okay, good. 
Tanya, Om Rebbe Yossi, Om Rebbe Yossi, Menayin L'Revi B'Kodesh Apostle. Tell now we're talking about Sheni Meng Shlishi B'Truma. How do we know the Shlishi can make a Revi for Kodesh? Something is, which is with the Kochim, sacrificial meat. How do we know it can be invalidated? Right. Uh, well, revi, it stops at Revi, it doesn't go beyond Revi. Revi is the equivalent of Apostle. A Shlishi can make a Revi to yeah, Apostle it. He says, neither v b'kodeshet posul. Again, the word posul means he cannot pass it on. Vidinu uma b'chusi kipurin shemuta b'truma. Right? There's a loch, a person, a yoledis, a zov. They have to bring korbanos. When do you bring the korban? When do you bring the korban? The eighth day. Before that, is he permitted the truma? The night no. before? No, he's, truma is permitted. He goes to the mikvah. After he counted seven clean days, nighttime comes. He could eat truma. Can't eat kachim until when? Till the next morning when he brings his korban. Yeah. Right? So we have a kalvah chomer. Vedinu. Ma'am chusi kipurim shemuta b'truma. Stop. Posl b'kodesh. Now, and what is truma? We said a sheni makes a shlishi by truma. Correct? So he can eat truma, but he cannot eat kachim. Correct? Shemuta b'truma, posl b'kodesh. Shlishi should apostle betruma, and odin she has a revi bekodesh. There's no question. A tful yom touches kochim. What happens to the kochim? It's gone. And yet, although he's permitted the truma, and we know by truma a sheni makes a shlishi. So if that's the case, that by kochim it makes a revi. She has a revi bekodesh. V'lamadu shlishi lekodesh min atoro. Revi mikal v'chomer. Where do we find Shlisha by Kodesh is Minat Torah? Minolon, Dechsiv, Vabosa, Sheyiga, Bechol Tomei, Lo Ye Ochel. Wait one second. It says, The meat that touched Kol Tomei, Lo Ye Ochel, Milo Askinu, the Noga Bishani. The Posse isn't speaking where it touched the Shani. Okay? Vomer Achmonu, Lo Ye Ochel. So therefore, once, so once I've established by Kodesh and Shlishi, Based on the concept, you don't say dayo. So I have a post that tells me shlishi. Right? So what, if so, so what do we say? Revim, kal v'chomer, kedamoran, like we said until now. Om Reb Yochanan, tam b'ribi enu yodea. See, b'ribi means, what he's saying now, he says he doesn't get it. He doesn't, b'ribi means odum godel, the godel ador. What the godel ador is saying, tam shor reb yosi shu, chochem godel ador, enu yodea, ma shalom et revi b'kodesh, he says, it's, it's obvious it's not a valid Kalvachomer. Rabbi Yossi say, how do I need the Revi by, 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 by Kochim? I learn it from Kalvachomer. And he quite supposed So if I know there's a Shlisha by Kochim, I definitely know there's a Revi. So, so Rabbi Yossi says, Tam Rabbi Yossi Mao, I don't understand what, what, where he's coming from. Sharei Tshuvoso B'Tzido. Oichel Abo Machmas Tful Yom Hu Yochiach. The food that's touched by a tful yom indicates a posel b'truma. They know a revi, b'kodesh, right? The tanyo abishol omer tful yom tchilu l'kodesh. Letami sheni v'lipsul echod. Letami shnaim v'lipsul echod, right? What does that mean? It, we, it cannot go beyond, it goes, Shani Shlishi, Shlishi does not go beyond Shlishi. cannot go beyond Shlishi. That's Lifsel Bechod. Right? He puzzles that, and the Rameer Omer Metami Echod, Oposel Echod. Chama Omrim, Shem Sheposel Ochle Chuma, Va Omashke Chuma, Kach Posel Ochle Kodesh, Omashke Kodesh. Second on this, two seconds. This, this is a hold, hold on. This is a chaymer bekodesh in, in Chagigo. These are rabbinical chumris uh, milus. Yeah, 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 yeah. Tfulyom Zemi 
ואוסס חבר ושלישי, ושניהם קרויים טמאים שמקלקלים את הזכרים, והשלישי פוסל רביעי, לאוסו עצמו פוסל, אבל לא יפסול הזכרים במגו. מי אומר תמי אחד, פוסל אחד, שריהו כשאר שני, פוסל את שום נגיד... אוקיי, נוסף, הוא סתם יותר.